your three minute question and answer period for the TD Entrepreneurship Challenge will now begin. How did your team secure funding for this project? We were able to get it from multiple revenue streams. So the first being project accelerators, especially the one that came from the uh, Savvy Foundation uh, for international collaborations. We are also able to secure funding through our faculty and our university. Next question. Did you review the market to see if any other similar programming already existed? Yes, in the female empowerment sector, there are so many different kinds of streams for women to find this kind of service. Where we really differ ourselves is by creating a collaboration of all these different services in one area and giving women from different communities a space to connect, even if they may be a part of a different organization. Next question. Can you clarify what you achieved this year versus previous years? This year, we're really able to pivot more uh, hybrid model to make sure that we're accessible to all women across Canada, across the world. We are able to impact more than 11 countries with this new model, especially making sure that we're recording uh, to utilize these uh, event recordings in the future, as well as impact additional women. Our YouTube channel accounted for about two thirds of our overall impact numbers at the end of the year. Next question. How did you develop the curriculum or content for your program and did you engage with any partners? Our curriculum really came together through a mixture of collaborating with uh, different types of women, different age groups, uh, different gender identities, and we're really developing alongside the women that we're working with. So these She Talks forums are picked by the public. Um, our ambassador program skill trainings are developed in conjunction with our high school students and our skill training and professional development of our She Leads members is really done alongside them. Next question. Which area of your project do you see as the most innovative and why? Really the way that we organize the, the use of social media and collaborating with different communities in one space. Our She Talks forums are able to stream across um, multiple different social media platforms. We're able to advertise to women across the world, across Canada, and really use globalization as a tool for success in our programming to make sure that we're catering to every type of woman because there's not just one kind of woman. There's so many different ones. Um, and we wanted to make sure that we are encompassing every kind of woman. Next question. What was the biggest challenge you faced when implementing this project and how did you overcome it? So the biggest challenge that we faced was promotion of our events. Instead of having posters around campus, we used Instagram and Facebook, their algorithms, in order to promote our events. We also collaborated with other pages and ran giveaways. Next question. Your time has now expired. Thank you.